John Sloan stands in alongside the victorious Chris Des Edwards who tonight defeated Josh Abraham via unanimous decision. Back to winning ways tonight, Chris. How happy yeah, do you feel to, to get a win in front of this crowd at this arena? Yeah, I'm, all, I'm over the moon, you know, to get, put the performance in and come away with a win. It's always better than coming away with a loss, but, you know, I, I'm really, really thrilled, so I, I'm so happy. When you look at your career chronologically, you know, all your wins have kind of come consecutively and all your losses have kind of come consecutively. Does that ever play into your mindset at all? Or do you feel that that kind of domino affects your motivation? I mean, what was the mindset <coughs> coming into this fight, coming off, uh, off two losses? Um, it's hard for me, you know. I, I don't ever lack motivation and the results have never really got on top of me as such because I'm happy go lucky guy, you know, and I do come here just to just to put on a, a performance and entertain people, you know, and I enjoy this sport. I know someone that's, you're just doing it for the sake of it or to make a name for myself. Me, Marshman, Tank, me and Jack more so. We've done this since we let, since we was in school, since, you know, since the beginning. So we, we don't really know no different. We've all had, um, we've all had ups and we've all had downs and we always just brush it off, get a team back together and, and get back in there. So like you said, the more losses you pick up, the pressure does mount up a bit, but it's just how you deal with it. And if you let it get on top of it, it will get on top of it. If you don't, it won't. Second fight at 45 tonight. How did you feel coming into this? Obviously, Josh was the bigger guy, but you know, I'd say as, as a featherweight, you're deceivingly strong for kind of your size, size and stature. Is 45 where you see your foreseeable future at this point? Yeah, at, at the moment, yeah. I, you know, and <coughs> like I just said, there, um, Lewis now, as, as you heard, making the adjustments for this fight compared to the first fight. Whereas it was my first fight at 45, I could make the weight easy. I was not not motivated, but it was just lethargic regarding, you know, Corey just won. Um, regarding um, the approach to the actual weight cut, so I treated it different. I've actually cut the featherweight this time, put the weight on, and I've done it properly. I made the adjustments with obviously performing with it and, and carrying the extra weight. So. What did you expect from Josh coming into this fight? Obviously he's a good Jets guy, really tricky off his back. Had you in a bit of an iron bar at one point, you stayed calm, composed, dug your head right into the outside of his knee. Any danger at that point? No, no, I was just keeping calm and um, like I said, I was baiting him quite a lot on a few things because I think he thought I was a bit uh, wet behind the ears on, on some of it, like, but obviously I was, I was using it to my advantage as you saw. Um, <coughs> I, th I thought we was going to stand and bang for uh, for um, three rounds really, but we got an exchange at the start and I thought, oh, do you know what, use your head, not be a crowd pleaser, let's, let's get this win back and, and perform in all areas like I know I can, so I just went went uh, as it did, you know. Mm -hmm. The rumour is Cage Warriors come back here September, October, is that when you'll be looking to return or is it possible you might get one in before then or but what's, what's again, your plans? Again, I'm married at um, the end of November, so I'm hoping to uh, sneak a quick one in before the wedding, like if, uh, if I can. So we'll, we'll see how that go. Obviously, I've left all the planning and everything to the misses, so I haven't really got to worry about that. <laughs> so it would be nice to get another one in just uh, just before the end of the year, sort of thing. Chris, thanks so much. Thank you very much. Cheers, mate. Thank, Thank you. you. Uh,